hi aries welcome back to the channel aries the emperor here i am back with another general reading for all of my aries collective if you guys are new here welcome this is an all aries channel for all of my aries placements cross watchers you are welcome as well to everyone just take in mind this reading may or may not resonate and that is okay all right do not force the reading and always a special thank you to all of you guys who like and subscribe to the channel i'm grateful for all of your comments your shares um, to those of you who donate book personal readings shop the website all of my information is listed in the description box down below if you would like to connect with me book personal readings or check out my second channel all right where i read for all 12 signs so let's jump into it you guys without further ado you read the title sun in gemini moon in aquarius at this time all right someone has been given a heavy warning about you a strong warning when it comes to you here all right and let's see why we're gonna pull some messages and see what comes out for you i'm feeling like let's pull from the what's tea deck and and see what messages come out for you guys first here okay let's make it a little interesting here as i feel called to pull from this deck um so that's exactly what we're going to do gemini energy has to do with community um it could have to do with family it could have to do with debating it could have to do with talk gossip um, rumor mill and uh, accompanied by the moon being in Aquarius um, that has everything to do with acquaintances friends all right so-called friends and family you know um, that sort of thing or just your workplace people that you have to associate with you know on a day-to-day -day basis or, or wish that you didn't associate or maybe no longer associate you know because they may have had something to say about you that was untrue about you they treated you unfairly poorly you know unkind let's see what comes out for you guys here i see why is this a queen or a king rising is what you are and that's what people are being warned about you that it's a king coming through it's a, a queen coming through it's aries the collective coming through bankrupt and you have no more fucks to give <laughs> when it comes when it all boils down to it um i feel like somebody's money is no longer uh, is 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 no longer good you know where where you coming from you know somebody's energy is is no longer valid um, where, where you coming from you know because simply this talking shit people have been warned i feel like spirit is handing out warnings you know it's just like trying to curse me you curse your own tongue you know when you do something like that collective and i feel like that is um the type of energy that you may be dealing with here a bunch of fans a bunch of groupies unnecessarily hating or, or feeling a way about you. You know, if somebody has enough time and can put enough effort um, into worrying about what you're doing, then they ain't. Okay, you read the card. And not only that, they are. They're a fan. You should let them join your fan club. <laughs> and that's what spirit. Some of y'all could be getting to the point in life here where you will be um experiencing groupies and fans or just already you may be a hometown a hometown celebrity um but that's the energy that i feel there so this could be a warning um too busy winning you know that's the energy that that spirit is trying to keep you in or that's the energy that people see you in or that's the vibe that's going around that's warning any and everybody that wants to come up against you, the warrior. <laughs> what other messages, spirit? Like these apologies are past due. These feelings and the wanting to share and open up to you, a lot of this energy is past due. You know, somebody's getting a warning about that, you know. It's too late, it's past due. It's, it's, it's been sent to collections, you know, which is the higher ups. And after that, you know, spirit and your guys, they kind of handle that sort of thing afterwards because you're freed of it. No more debt, no more baggage, you know, and, and that's a, a strong warning. That's, that's what I feel like someone's being warned about you. 
heavy warning when it comes to you. Now, it's also an energy like they're not going to be able to get close to you. They're going to have to be a groupie because you're not going to give them the time of day. So they're not going to get the opportunity to even get in your space. You know, that could be a warning or somebody's already starting to feel like this is where things are headed. Like you are through. You've checked out. Cyber bully. This card always comes out, you guys. Like, are y'all really being watched and, and gang stalked or just... This is fake accounts. Um, this is people who are suffering in their own personal lives and watching you not suffer or be unbothered. Fake flexing, that type of energy here. And you probably don't care about any of it. You know, it, it, it don't bother you. So, and you're not bothering anybody. So it, it's just an energy. What they say, people are bothered by the fact that you're unbothered. Um, you're not, you're not to be bought. Um, and, and you definitely like, even when you do show off Aries, I feel like it creates like this level of maybe it makes people want to stalk you because you have this very seductress type of energy about you. I feel like whether you're ma male or feminine, you know, it's a way that you, even if you are showing off, I feel like it's unintentional and a lot of times here is, it's just like with the fire signs you're not gonna miss them. I don't care whether it's big mouth Sagittarius or flashy ass Leo, you know, or Aries is the boss. So you're gonna feel that energy like with the chest out and head up, you know, walking in the room, you know, you're a cardinal sign. So you're gonna lead some, in some way, shape or form here. Um, however that looks in whatever area personally in your life here, people could say you act rich or maybe you were rich or not. Then people say you're not rich anymore. You're trying to act like that. It is something that it's not. Um, or people could feel like you floss or they could be seeing getting warning signs of your money getting better. Um, or, or just, just uh, a change in your lifestyle or who you hang out with the places that you eat now, the things that you buy and put in your body, uh, you know, just changes around your house. You could be purchasing a new vehicle or just anything, you know, when people feel like it don't add up in their head, then that's when they get to, to start making up shit. And, and, and then they be trying to create a, a bad reputation for you the whole time. You know, they just creating more groupies and more fans. They helping you win. That's ammunition. You give Aries some, you trying down at Aries, Aries, you're supposed to take that energy, that fire, and channel it into your glow up, your comeback. Okay. I was going to say, what did the cards uh, say? But I can't see it. One second, y'all. Okay. Threatening. Okay. Intimidating. Threatened. Bothered. By who? You. All right, let's pull from some tarot. I've had enough. Okay, if someone's threatening, threatened because you're winning. Someone, I guess, maybe got warning um, that you're not playing. You know, maybe you are coming in and you taking everything that belongs to you and some. You know, maybe you coming in the joint and sticking them up that with Empress energy here. You shocking everybody, you know, with what you can do and what you have done and accomplished. And you deserve it, you know. People just sometimes, you know, everybody's different in their own unique way. And then when you get to really show what you have to bring, um, it can make other people feel away because maybe you you just so different that people are not used to seeing that some seeing somebody come the way that you come, or or like just seeing an individual that's been created um, as as such as yourself here. So it's it's just it can be threatening, clearly someone is threatened okay knight of wands there's that leo that fire energy i was just speaking on here and look somebody don't look too happy as to what they're seeing all right maybe their numbers are going down and your numbers are going up your favor is going up you know you're you, you coming up higher in the ranks you're being spoken on more. You're being watched more. You're being respected more. You're being loved more. And most importantly, source is, is shining on you more. And that's better than any man or woman type energy that you could um, experience here, you know, because it's from the one that helped, the, the one that created you. 
and it's the ultimate say so and so on is being warned you know that you spiritual too you high rank too that's the strong heavy warning that's being given out okay this didn't necessarily come out so what other messages spirit you are being protected um you may have protection some of you may need to protect yourself and that could be just in any make sure your home is secured um some of you may need to install cameras or maybe you are installing some type of home uh camera system here just for your own safety here okay what other messages spirit this could be a warning for you as well you know just tighten up aries empress yeah tighten up because you already looking like a bag um, a, a bag of a, a million bucks all right you looking a little too plush in someone's eyes and the empress opposite of the empress is the emperor you know this is an energy of definitely i feel like somebody taking their their negativity or their fire energy out on you whole time you know you're someone somewhere minding your business some of you guys could be um getting ready to expect here congratulations um some of you guys could be manifesting a pregnancy here um congratulations to you in advance as well um or, or this is just you in general this could be masculine or feminine energy but this is like a warning like the golden child is getting ready to be born and that's you aries you know spirits getting ready to birth something out of you here that is um unmatched um it's, it is definitely top tier seven of cups you can get ready you know if people i guess someone feels like you get options um you get to to be the first or it's just like like i said here is is an energy like you deserve to be there just like everybody else does but it makes them feel away when they actually see you um coming up the steps you know and getting ready to enter the the building and being ush ushered in first class type energy because that's what the empress that type of energy is here and it's it's, it's not temporary it's it's um it's a consistent type of thing here or something that's going to be happening or going um in your favor you know um, on a consistent basis here like something that you're going to get used to um, and it's a warning, you know, so get ready, you know, if you're not already in the energy, get ready page of swords here. Cause you got a lot of immature energy around you, um, that would like to, to not only take your spot, figure out how you got there, um, and create a lane for themselves here, maybe on your heels. Um, but this is Aquarius energy at the same time, or this just could be talk in general, you know, about what. The changes that are transpiring in your life the page of wands that is also fire energy aries you are spirit's new project all right and someone's being warned of that ace of wands yep it's official why are these in reverse congratulations aries congratulations in advance You know, and anybody that got a problem with it. Normally, the Ace of Wands is like a card with a really big stick in it. So I was going to say anybody that feels lucky can get banged with that spirit stick, baby. Eight of Coins or someone maybe wanting to give you a piece of their spirit stick uh, collective um, and, and you're no longer interested. And it's just basically like maybe some of you guys have moved on or decided that you are moving on and and somebody is still in the shadows lurking and still throwing things at the the wall and punching the air um because hey you're no longer in, interested in their spirit stick you have other choices and ones that gonna treat you better you know ones that know your worth um and are gonna do right by you you know not gonna play you um it's just like energy of somebody staying also like relationship wise somebody being here for the long haul this could be a warning for you as well in that um but also whatever this is that someone sees they're threatened and and they, it could be just your personal upgrades or just person place or thing upgrades type energy coming into your life here eight of coins because this is a come up 
You've been working for this. You work for this. Spirit is about to put you in a position to work for this. And, you know, it's, it's someone's getting a, a heavy warning. The spiritual streets are talking. Yeah, you worked up a, a heavy, a hearty appetite, Aries. Or right, it's like the energy that you're giving. You're hungry. And that could be threatening to others. Justice, five of cups. Somebody wants to point the finger at you. The Hermit, King of Wands. Just get focused here between now and Leo season. Virgo season, whatever you need to do to put in place, whatever you need to change about your routine, your day-to-day -day habits, um, and who's going to be a part of that and not a part of it. You know, this is, I feel like for a lot of you guys, like this is like big CEO type energy, you know, whether, you know, you're running a company or not, it's, it's we, we speaking on energy. Okay. Um, and yours, it sends out a clear, clear warning. Um, and let's clarify the King of Wands. I see somebody the next six months doing damn near a, th a 360. Like once you get on track this time, it's straight to the stars for somebody here. Seven of coins. Yep. It came out in reverse, which would mean the energy of wanting to see um, uh, your demise or a downfall, um, to see you fall back, to not see your plans go through as planned for something not to be prosperous for you. And they've been warned about this a few times. Hierophants, Taurus energy now. Ten of Wands, yeah, to burden you. Someone would rather see you burdened than to see you grow. Ain't that something? Five of Coins, aka the Five of Pentacles. They'd rather see you in embarrassment. And they've been warned about this energy, this behavior, these thoughts. Because like I said, you curse your own tongue when you try and curse me, a.k.a. you. People have to realize that, you know, you laughing at somebody today, that could be you tomorrow. And I feel like somebody being warned. Or this is your warning. Take it how it resonates. Knight of Swords, Four of Coins, which is the Four of Pentacles. It's Gemini energy, Capricorn energy. Yeah, somebody's trying to think. They're thinking long and hard about what they said, what they did. They can't take it back. Nothing they can say nor do. Tower can change that. Aries energy is coming down. Kaboom. 
Let me give you guys a close up of this tower. Do you see this? Yeah. Someone's been warned. The universe is sending word around. Give me one more spirit. The Haynes man. Big warnings. This 12th house, Pisces energy. I mean, this could have everything to do with I don't know. It's like a, like you're not the delusional one. Maybe you are the delusional one, right? But it's 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 like giving the energy of like people not being able to discredit you. And like I said, not being able to, they can't block you. And it's like a, a realization that you come to or they come to, or like they've already come to. And whatever's been cast out because um, 12th house can have to do with karma and, and endings as well, you know, and the occult and, and hidden enemies and spell work, among other things. Um, and it's like somebody going too far doing too much um and that's that energy of of what you do to me comes back onto you because your heart is in the right place and you're going for inward healing the world here you're ending and achieving whether being destructive or, or creating destructive types of, of situations here did I not say someone is upset you know that you're walking up the steps and getting ready to walk through the door warning give me one more spirit and I'm out The chariot, and so are you, Aries. <laughs> I love it. Hey, make way. And if you're not ready, you better get ready. Okay. Hit that like and subscribe button for more messages from me. All right. I'll catch you guys later. Ciao.